So in other words, there'd be something like the ones that uh, the uh, staff has already given us on page nine, a findings to approval. Funding. I'm recommending this with amended and or new conditions. I got some higher needs. I paid cash for my last two houses. I married my wife. I take a box of chocolates home and some uh, rose, roses. And when you have the best, you don't need the rest. And I've been married for 56 years. Through the application, and they're willing to stipulate to that. They also have a problem pointing out clearly just the friends of the business that are accessible to the extent that those owners want that. Uh, we could have issues with the trespass, so that's the only question there. Um, also, they have no problem with it. They, they have no intention of putting any sign except on the building itself and not on the Amador side. That's their intention anyway. Also, the emergency access, they have every intention of securing that with a warrant. So, all of those issues there, uh, I'm stipulating to those conditions. Okay. Yes, please. The applicant shall pay the cost to the city for installing no parking signs along West Gate, West Gate Court, and that would include both the east and west call, call signs. The sign would be approved by the city of Las Cruces <coughs> and in accordance with the city of Las Cruces design standards. The signs would be installed prior to operation of the club. The applicant shall post a large visible warning sign at the entrance of the club advertising, advising drivers that parking is prohibited along West Cape Gate Court and vehicles parked there will be towed at owner's expense. We <coughs> shall urge patrons not to park on West Gate Court. So you're just installing your language in that first condition? Yes. Okay. Uh, all those in favor say aye. 